BJ's here, get your BJ's, $3. <laughs> <laughs> All right, today we are back with Ted 2, and I thoroughly enjoyed the first movie. Absolutely hilarious. You guys seem to love it as well. And you all told me to watch the sequel. No idea if it's going to be funnier. I imagine it can't be. I don't know if they're going to get any better writing, but we will see. And speaking of fluffy toys, I am making my own currently. Not sure if it is out by the time this video comes out, but if you do want to see more of it or know when it drops, check out that link in the description below. So now let's not wait. We're going to jump straight into it. A talking teddy bear is about to marry his girlfriend. Oh, he's getting married now? America doesn't give a shit about anything. Do you? Who does though? I don't care about anything. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Let me kiss the bear. Must have been love at first, past nip insertion. Teddy, this is the best day of my life. I just love you so much. Why are you chewing gum on your wedding day? Fifty shades of bear on you tonight. Let's go get face. Okay. <laughs> hey, congrats, you mofos. Oh, hey, guy. Is this your new boyfriend? What happened to Ryan Reynolds? My new boyfriend, Rick. He's a gourmet chef. He knows how to toss a salad. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> you. You. Deal. <laughs> <laughs> Two gay bros. You okay there? You look a little down. Wait, where's this girl gone? Begging for it. Look at her, she wants it bad. Oh yeah, she wants more than just a piece of delivery. <laughs> what the hell are you watching? This is not legal. Dude, that's somebody's daughter. Oh, oh Jesus, come on. It's been six months since you guys got divorced. You knew it was coming though. The relationship kind of sucks. She was the boss, so. Hey, hey, big day, huh, bud? Speak of bud, look at that product placement right there. Does Mark Wahlberg sponsored by Bud Light? Cause it was same as that in Transformers. The line with a dude and I bet you can't even spot him. <laughs> Who's on coke? God knows what I'm watching. Morgan Freeman? What the hell is he doing in this? I mean, I don't know if it's just me that doesn't like musicals, this type of thing, but I can't imagine anyone just like, because I almost really cried laughing at this the whole time. One year later, oh no. The honeymoon is over. It is long gone. I think you're bleeding us dry. I need clothes for work, all right, Teddy? What do you mean? You, you wear a smock. It's the way he's wearing the wife beater. You better not start beating her. He's sitting on three books. Ryan you, to climb the corporate not, fence here, Nobody's okay? in there to look at your yes. ass. Corporate fence? Is a cashier? You should have married Robert Chico. <gasps> he had a dick. Oh no, don't go there. Did you just call me? <laughs> 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 yeah, I'm gonna come up there and I'm gonna kick your f ass! Shut up, bitch! Jesus, it's just me out! Hey, I'm really sorry! Yeah, me too. She's <laughs> worse than us! Yeah, she's our enemy now. She's our enemy now. Jesus. Things, I bet some people have those living conditions though. I'm so lucky there's no one near me that's that annoying. I came back five minutes later, she was looking at black That seems like every time you go online, you're two clicks away from black Look. It is true. I'll Google Grand Canyon. Look, it says, did you mean black? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I run into this issue all the time. You have to click. After I was staying at my friend's apartment, if you want to join. But I got, I got an early day tomorrow. What? Oh, okay. When a girl's up being this forward, what are you doing rejecting? I put my cell number on there too. Oh my God, make it harder for us, but Jesus. I get back in the game, man. Oh, don't start this shit, all right? It's six years of my life with the wrong girl. Well, it's not a waste. You learn a lot. You had a good time, I'm sure. That's how you gotta look at it. Always good to find new ways to surprise your lover. Yeah, I gotta take a leak. It's true. If you don't believe me, you should have watched my Fifty Shades of Grey reaction. Jay Leno comes in here for gay bathroom. Sorry, my mistake. <laughs> Didn't Seth MacFarlane just like text these guys? Come on, this amazing joke for five seconds of your time. Hey. As I was saying, he definitely texts all these guys. I've been led to understand that tricks are children. Is that correct? Well, I, I mean, they say, uh... uh enforced by law. <laughs> you need to get that bus or what? I got a watch taken, actually. Hey. I won't forget what you've done for me here today. We haven't done anything. To be fair, I've spoken to people who work in like, just like retail or normal shops. There's some weird people that come in, man. You wouldn't even believe the stories. Some people are strange. How the hell do you take a broken marriage and make it work again? A baby. You have yourselves a baby. A baby? You see them two white niggas over there? <laughs> <laughs> so that again, them white what? They just be two sad ass white niggas. Waiting for downtown Abbey. <laughs> I mean, check wrong. 
<laughs> it is true though. I mean, the amount of people that would split up if there wasn't a baby to look after. The divorce rate is already 50%. I can't do this no more. And that's why I want to have a baby. He would be the worst father in the world. Is it going to be a human baby though? Or like a baby teddy? I think you would make an awesome mom. Oh my God, are you kidding me? I would like kick so much ass at mom in. So what do you say? We all good? I love you so much. Oh, they just had the worst argument of all time, but now it's all fixed. <laughs> I guarantee that's how he sits when he watches himself in Transformers movies. I gotta have a baby. You? Yeah, yeah, we talked about it today. How do you guys... We, uh, we gotta find a sperm donor. Oh no, they're actually gonna have a baby, baby. I honestly thought they were gonna get a teddy bear. You want Flash Gordon to father your child? Yeah, I say do it. I don't think he will, because can you imagine... You're the dad of, like, your friend's kid? It's a bit weird. And they kind of have a right to, like, see the kid whenever they want. Hey, can I use your laptop? Yeah, go ahead. Oh, wait, what's gonna be on the laptop? Black? What the f***? There's so much... <laughs> Thousands of files here. Well, I've been meaning to click. Thousands of files. Who downloads it? Clockwise rim. Counterclockwise rim. Yeah. Well, sometimes you like seeing the tongue go the other way. Chicks with. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> He's so single. All right. The next chick you meet, you are getting back in the game. Fine. I got it. Done. To be fair, prawn will mess you up so bad. Even a man like Terry Crews was destroyed by it. <laughs> Circuits could still be reconstructed if somebody worked at it. We gotta bury it in the harbor. <laughs> They're burying the evidence so hard. They're treating him like treating the laptop like it's Megatron. Sorry, all the Transformer jokes are coming in today. Oh look, I did a lot of blow in the 80s and my sperm counts are a little low. He's shooting blanks. One fella's having his own I am legend in my nutsack. <laughs> His own I am legend. He's the only guy in the world whose sperm is even close to Flash Gordon's. We sneak into his house off in his sleep and sneak out with a sperm. Oh, wait, what? Who? This is a crime. I wonder how lucrative donoring is. Anyone interested? Uh... Thing is, I'm kind of uncomfortable with the idea of unknown children out there. They may be out there, I don't know. Yeah, can I help you? Are you, uh, Tom Brady? Oh, that's Tom Brady? I don't know what he looks like. I I'm English. I swear he just got burnt by his wife so hard. <laughs> Idiot. Oh, that's the plan. Well, destroyed the AC, leaves his window open, and then go and <laughs> whack him off. Who is doing the whacking? Oh, what? Is that even possible in your slip? That is the cutest outfit. Wait, why is he wearing a raincoat? I want to get any jizz on me. Two league MVPs. Now let's give him a hand to this red solo cup. Oh, this is literally grape. I've never done this before. Well, neither have I. You do it to yourself? I'm nervous, right? What if he doesn't like the way I'm doing it? He deserves the best. Like yourself. <laughs> he does deserve the best. <laughs> oh. oh my God. What the hell? Oh God. Wait, we just need a moment here. Sure, sure. ah! <laughs> <laughs> hey, damn, what a throw. Perfect spot. But only this film can make jokes about grape and someone's sleep, and it's not bad. Why did you just come to me? You were the first person I wanted to go to. No, I didn't want to put you in an awkward position. Plus, after seeing your laptop, I, I didn't think you had any left. <laughs> yeah, it's just dust coming out. Thunder buddies for life, remember? Thunder buddies for life. Yeah, I bet he didn't think he would try and whack off Tom Brady when he got him for Christmas. What's a 317? Someone's trying to steal Tom Brady's jizz again. <laughs> <laughs> it's got its own crime number. I always wonder, how do the police people just remember all the numbers? You know? Oh god, he's starting early. What is that? What the hell? Getting ready, dude. What do you mean you're getting ready? What do you, yeah. think, what do you think you are? Red lobster? What are you doing? What do you think I <laughs> John Bennett. Right this way, I'll show you where to deposit your specimen. Who the hell says that? Deposit your specimen? I, I don't think this is the place to pick up women. I'm John Bennett. I know. I just said your name. What's that negative riz? Hey, when I'm done here, how about a drink? Uh, I didn't, I don't, I don't mean this. I you swallow a video I like Asian teen stuff preferably. There's a loop right there. All right. Asian teen. Thanks. I'm genuinely interested in how much can you get paid for this? Can you inform me? Where you guys store all the uh, stuff? The intermediary station before insemination. So, a storage full of cum. <laughs> the cum room. <laughs> so, uh, how'd you get into this line of work? Do you, do you just love cum? <laughs> you wanna, you wanna have a look? Yeah. Uh, oh, the gum. I mean, sure, why not? I guess. And eliminate hereditary diseases. Wait, really? You can alter the to change that? Excuse me, I'll be right back. You wanna see your kid? I can see it from here. Thanks. Yeah. Dude, take a closer look. Oh, uh, this is gross. Why is it so like watery? The oh, sh oh God. Oh. Find something. Scoop it up. There's containers over there. Get scoop oh, it up. Oh, what? Where's the seat? Oh, that's not gonna work. Oh. 
Looks like the videos he was watching on that laptop. What the hell? Post this on Facebook. No! <laughs> Hashtag <girl> Mondays. <laughs> that is such an expensive accident. Rejected sickle cell samples. Ah, uh, you hear that, Johnny? You're covered in rejected black guy sperm. You look like a Kardashian. Oh my god, that is such a good line. Wow. <laughs> He's so good, that line. Why was this funny in the first one? Morning, Mr. Jessa. This my is name's a... Donnie. <sighs> Hit again. He's back? Oh no! Bloody Savile! I won't be able to perform the implantation procedure. Tammy Lynn, you're no longer fertile. Why is everyone infertile in this? I mean, the rates are going up. Compromise. That looks fine. This is Tammy Lynn's. Oh! <sighs> when I saw this, I threw up. Almost quit medicine. <laughs> it's gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be okay. It really isn't. <laughs> That's the most honest doctor I've ever seen. There's another issue, and in the eyes of the state, you are not a person. Wait, what? I mean, he's a bear. You are classified as property. Oh, wow. Be careful. Your adoption request may have raised some red flags. It may leave you quite vulnerable. To what? I don't understand. Is that for real? Did they actually tell you that? They said I'm property. Like you're a thing? Well, like garbage or a piece of shit? <laughs> <laughs> he had to say that. I've never voted. Don't pay taxes. I mean, hell, this is the first job I ever had. Can I see it for a moment? Oh, no, now we're getting fired. Can't legally keep you on as an employee. Technically. Technically not a person, yeah. Guys, whole life's ruined. You're fired. He should have been a YouTuber, man. Imagine watching that. Poor baby booty. It's always going to be empty. Why'd you buy it already? Your marriage to Tammy Lynn McCafferty is unrecognized by the state, invalid, and hereby annulled. I'm invalidating their marriage? Why do they care so much, though? That's so weird. Just let them live. It's like what happens when you get cancelled. Let's take you down. Now, you ask me, we gotta fight it. I mean, we get a lawyer, and we'll sue the government for your civil rights. Sue the government? It's a good plan. But we don't know any lawyers. All our friends make sandwiches. Google Boston lawyers. What's the lawyers? Look at that black. <laughs> <laughs> I love that recurring joke. This is a very complicated case you have here. Well, everybody says you're the best in town. If he's the best in town, surely you can't afford him. I won second prize in a beauty contest. Just saying Monopoly stuff? I'll drive around the block and I'll be back with $200. <laughs> Hello? Oh! Hi. Oh, she's in this as well. The mean girl's uh, rain check. Is there a problem? You know, it's just this is a really important case. I mean, Ted has already lost his job. His marriage is... Yeah, we cool. really appreciate your time, but I think just take a seat and... Get <laughs> <laughs> just because she's smoking? Yeah, hire her up right now. Oh, I'm Samantha Jackson. Wait, wait, wait. What's your middle name? Leslie. So you're <laughs> Sam L. Jackson. <laughs> Who is that? Any movie ever, he's the black guy. <laughs> So true. <laughs> uh, what do you say? Can you get me my life back? I'm gonna try. Can you help me get home? I'm having a really hard time here, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't he like a coach veteran, though? Hey, bust it down. Just threw a boogie bomb. DA says, Ted, do you consider yourself to be human? Objection is sustained. Guilty. Speculation. Hearsay. Bailiff. Everyone else watching the dip trial. Oh, yeah, they're definitely getting married as well. No way. And them too as well. You know, Ted, if you legally become a person, you're gonna need a last name. Okay, okay, I got one. Plubba Lang. <laughs> what? Still Rocky Three. Hello. Boxing movies? The boxing, but uh, you never you know, seen. I haven't seen them. I've told you this. You don't know Samuel L. Jackson. You don't know Rocky. You are literally pop culture illiterate. Yeah, this is what everyone says every time I do a video. Thank you for reminding me. I answered this in a Q&A I did. Please check it out. You're still asking how I haven't seen films. You tell me who wrote The Great Gatsby. Hitler? F. Scott Fitzgerald. <laughs> Who's that? Well, why are you saying f him? You just said F. Scott Fitzgerald. What, what, what is... <laughs> Ted Clubberlang. Get used to it. Ted Clubberlang. Is that what the third film's called? Hey, that is a sick Optimus ting, though. I don't know about the pony, though. New toy ideas from any and all employees? All right, come in. Wait, what's his plan, though? Is he the villain again? Like, making more Ted's or something? One of our Hasbro bears. Yes, I'm aware of the story. Have you seen this? Don't tell me it's because Hasbro own him. They can take him. If we could cut him open to see what makes him tick. Millions of Ted's for every child. I mean, it is a billion dollar idea though. Can't lie. The best lawyer in the world. No one's gonna kick up a legal fuss over property. Now, what exactly do you want from this? Just want a Ted for my very own. Freak. I mean, I'm acting like I don't want a Ted though. I would take one. I've never had Pringles on my steak before. 
Pringles on steak. That's a crime. Okay, I'm 90% sure Mark Wahlberg is just sponsored by Bud Light. Things I'm not proud of. BJ's here. Get your BJ's. Get your red hot BJ's. Toothless and ready to go. Just $3. <laughs> $3. Where's my wallet? His way of saying I should ask you out. You know, I, I am a little bit curious. How is it that a guy like you is unattached? Oh, well, I'm a busy man, you know. Far too busy. Johnny, come on. It's almost 7 o'clock. We got to get up there. What is it? Oh, on Tuesday nights, we get f***ed up and throw apples at joggers. <laughs> oh, that sounds fun. I mean, no one likes joggers. Hey, listen. I run, but yeah, no one likes them. Hey, work out! No one wants to see that when you're chilling. you get for exercising <laughs> so true though it's like cyclists no one likes cyclists if you're a cyclist and you're wearing the full thing i'll throw worse than an apple at your head no one looks at a cyclist wearing the lycra and going that guy's cool if i've triggered any cyclists that uh, if we lose i'm gonna cut that judge brought your switchblade they patted us down on the way in here where'd you even hide oh prison wallet wait what do they call that for because the prison wallet's the What's the prison purse? Your opening statement, if you please. I would first like to thank the ladies and gentlemen of the jury. Isn't that Iron Man's dad? Does your dog deserve human rights? Your cat? Your toaster? Well, they don't speak English, so. So I urge you, ladies and gentlemen of the jury, don't wait too long to be right. I mean, most jury people just like, wanna go home. Erection sustained. <laughs> uh, why did you not choose to have a child of your own? Cause Teddy ain't got no dick. <laughs> <laughs> So you don't see him as your property. He's way more of a person than lots of other people. I mean, Steven Tyler? Kind of weird soccer mom looking goony monster? Who's that? I'll allow it. <laughs> Who is it? Wait, what did he say? Steven Tyler. <laughs> I just looked up his picture. Jesus. <laughs> Mr. Bennett. I hope your kids get bird flu. Mr. Bennett. <laughs> <laughs> Bird flu. And this is exactly what you've been doing to the Ted. And I said, sorry, sorry, the homos, the homos. This is exactly what you've been doing to the homos. Now piss off, all right? I'm standing up for me. Ted, what are you doing? Shut up. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> what a jammer, though. Angry bird. Do you remember when that came out? What a game. Call Ted Clubberlang to the stand. Yes. Ted Clubberlang. Mr. Clubberlang. Do you believe you have a soul? What? Did you think I would do at this moment? Objection. Overruled. <laughs> oh, oh my man. brother! My... And I don't think I ought to be treated any different. Capable of love, aware of his own consciousness. Aren't dolphins as well, or things, monkeys? But hey, I'm on Ted's side. The bear products are affixed with an electronic device in the chest. Would you please press your chest? But how does that prove his property? This was all before the wish. I love you! No further questions. Surely the jury are like, yeah, he's real, who cares? Oh, is it bad that they're taking this long? You know, Johnny, it may be time to play the Beetlejuice card, say, in his name three times. What? Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. Shut up! <laughs> what does that do? <laughs> be on our side, he'll help us. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why that's funny, I've never seen Beetlejuice. Uh, I hope it's the little, um, the little Beetlejuice, the guy. Not the film. Has the jury reached a verdict? Uh, yes, we have, Your Honor. Um, Please. In the case of Ted versus the Commonwealth, he is not a person. Oh, what? Piss off. You're gonna get one of these. Oos, 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 oos. Well, now he's getting nabbed. Why is he being treated differently than everybody else? We're gonna call Patrick Megan. Wait, is he the one who got that female midget into the Marines? Remember she was at a Veterans Day parade and somebody handed her a bunch of balloons and she's gone. <laughs> <laughs> what is that your thing? He's a sucker for media. Oh, for God's sake. Not again. That's such a good joke, though. In Ted versus Bud Light again. Go away. It's such product placement. No wonder they can afford these celebrities in this film. Let's try to overturn the verdict. It's such smart product placement. You thinking what I'm thinking? Let's go down to the improv and yell sad suggestions. We need a historical event. Oh, this is going to be gold. 9-11. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, maybe something else. Start with a person. Robin Williams. Okay, all right. For real, guys. For real. We, I, 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 Robin Williams on 9-11. All right. <laughs> Um, Epstein. How about a location? Let's go with a location. Epstein's Island. Who's in the Starbucks? Bill Cosby. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta go watch an improv and do this. This is gold. Too far. I love going to. St I've been going to like stand-up comedy shows lately. Some of them are so. The bad ones are so much funnier. Just 
Silence. Hey, Sam, how's your boring salad? It's actually delicious. Everybody always says, Salad's not nice. Have some cookie crisp. You need something nutritional. Cookie crisp. Oh, it takes me back. I always used to ask my dad to buy me cookie crisp. He would never, never have begged for it. Where the hell's my coffee? I've been waiting for 10 minutes. I'm so sorry, sir. I hey, that is a crack. A build that's what we call a builder's bum in England. Hey, 20 bucks, I can toss a cookie crisp into his ass crack. <laughs> <laughs> you guys making trouble over here? Let's try to keep your boyfriend under control here, yeah? Oh. Oh, he's not my boyfriend. Good. Good. Girls don't act like this. Why is this from lying? Come off it. There's only one person this has happened to, Chris Evans. And even then it doesn't happen. What are the f me eyes? Yeah, it's some women just have f me eyes. Do I have f me eyes? Give us the ring, my precious <laughs> eyes. I mean she kinda does though. I, mean, I can't lie. <laughs> Well, Sam, it's been 20 minutes. You want to take over? I don't know why this film is fine the first, though. You're gonna have to wait till tomorrow to get the car out. Spend the night here? Yeah, it'll be fine. We just gotta find some firewood. Sleeping in a barn. Isn't that what they're doing Gone with the Wind or something? I don't even know. Maybe I'm making it up. Wow. Hey, Ted! What the hell is a leaf for this stuff doing out in the middle of a... <laughs> what is it? A full farm? My God, heaven. Is that Jurassic Park music? The thing is though, why are they acting like that's heaven? I mean, you only need a couple buds to keep, get you set, so. The thing is, I just love the smell. I honestly do love the smell. Some people hate it, but I think it's a good smell. And I haven't smelled it for like years. I never smell it when I'm out anymore. This puts us in kind of an awkward position here. I don't want to put a big glass in my mouth. You sure? Soda can or something for us to make an actual bond. You just need an apple. I always wanted my ex-wife to get stolen with me. She never would, so. That's the cornerstone of any great marriage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true, right? You're really smart, you know that? Come you don't have a guy. Dude, have you seen the guys in Boston? Guys just in general, I'm not gonna lie. Take a look at this. I found a cowboy hat and a rifle and a guitar. Okay, it's not a low- Whoa! You play the guitar? A little bit. Just a little bit. Girl, I hate people who bring out guitars at any moment. I never know what to do when you're sitting in front of someone playing a musical instrument. Like, what do you do? Like this. Just smile. And then start singing? No, goodbye. Till I'm all alone. <laughs> what is this? Um, Who does this? Is it Sleeping Beauty? Who sings all the animals come? I thought this just doesn't have a place in a Ted movie, you know? A little sing song. And I, I don't think I, I find singing attractive like that, but why is this so romantic? Oh my god! The singing won him over? Surely it was the Smeagol eyes. Was it just kissing last night, or was there finger stuff? <laughs> There's always a little bit of. Oh, I was gonna do a finger movement, forget about it. Oh wow, he's doing it. <laughs> Get a picture quick! Oh, what the fuck? My amazing summer. God damn it. Gotta grab the balls a bit. Whoa, whoa. Watch where you're going. Hey, what the hell are you doing walking around dressed like Star Wars? It's Comic Con, you. Hey, Comic Con. Hey, I better see some of you guys at the London one in a month. I'm always there. Oh, hey, come on. It's not worth oh, it. Piss off. It's not worth it. <laughs> <laughs> Patrick Megan's got a classy setup, huh? And there is our first impression. <laughs> What's wrong with him? Ah. Oh, Morgan, I forgot I saw his name in the credits. This office is awesome. You ever bring chicks up here? What do you think? Oh, he does. See, the important thing about being human is making a contribution to society. You've done none of that. That's a fair point. Needs to do some volunteering or something. Ted, you could have been an inspiration to the world, a role model. He really does have a point, you know. You're Justin Bieber. Fuck you. <laughs> he needs help. I'm sorry you were not who I hoped you'd be. Hey, don't put the blame on him, though. He gave you some solid advice right here. Are those Tootsie Rolls just like to take? Those aren't supposed to be out. <laughs> let you guys down all over again. You didn't let us down, Sam. You did your best. Still the best thing that's happened to me in a long time. Basically saying, Ted can get effed. I've got you now. But you have fun talking Gollum here while I'm left with Ted. Who's Gollum? Oh, she's a model. <laughs> Yeah, she's a model. Length still. Whoa. Sorry, bro. Get him in Comic Con right now. Oh, God, speaking of. Savile's here. I mean, Ted's not a child, though. Who's a be known bestiality man? I don't know. I always have so much fun at Comic Con just walking around looking at everyone's outfits. Guy? What the hell is that? You know, I just feel at home among the outcasts. <laughs> hey, Spaz, how about that? Ah! Huh? 
<laughs> this is leaked footage of me at Comic Con. You guys down the biggest nerd of all. God damn it, that underwear had on it. <laughs> Are you Ted? Oh god, it's Donny. His eyes even look like Donny. All right, let's do this. Uh oh. Holy sh! The reveal. I have some big plans for you, Ted. Go to hell! Buy slugs, spaz. Hey, what the hell? Hey, Bumblebee! Love all the Transformer stuff. Hello? Johnny, Johnny, it's me. You gotta help me. It's Donnie. He's here. Ted, we gotta get to Comic Con. Come on. Maybe this is sponsored by Comic Con as well. Oh no. Which one's Ted? I mean, none of them are here. I can't see him. Uh, I can't see the real one. You just can't help but sing along. Touching you. I'm definitely not distracted by the, the girls in the back. Touching you. Isn't this just copying what Roger Rabbit did? Are alive. Ba, ba, ba. <laughs> <laughs> it's literally copying Roger Rabbit, that joke. See him anywhere? No. Hey, look at that, Black Widow. A talking teddy bear. They're about to announce a new Superman. Superman is Jonah Hill. <laughs> Jonah <laughs> That's kind of the perfect name. Brand new line of Transformers merchandise next fall. Yeah, Transformers! Brand new line of Decepticons. Oh, sick. Take a look. So many Transformers stuff. On oh, life-size Mark Goldberg. Our Titanfall in the background as a goated game. Hey, uh, back hallway past the photo booth. Come on. Thirsty Urkel. Love this place. Does look like fun. Who the hell are you? He really is extraordinary, isn't he? This is kidnapping! No, it's not. Your property. Your property. Happy guy. Right there. Death. <laughs> happy guy. That guy is so happy. Hey, Bennett! Stop my car. What the hell is wrong with you? Wait, what? When did he do that? <laughs> oh my. Three? Just a regular old teddy bear. I, I won't be any fun then, will I? We're gonna figure out what makes you real and then we're gonna make millions of tens. Surely it's not possible to make any more though. Like actually, they looked inside. I can never love you. What if I gave you a hand outside your pants while you ate an ice cream? What? But he wants that offer? I'll give you a minute. Oh my God. What? This is literally every crossover possible of everything I love. Godzilla's here, a Dalek? Chucky? Predator? <laughs> And it will help. <laughs> no, she looks so alike. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, this scene's so good. Maybe I gotta watch the OG Godzilla's. I'll see you in heaven, Ted. No! Ted, you okay, buddy? Oh, Johnny, thank God. I'm out. Yeah, that guy needs to leave. It's not worth the money at this point. You don't deserve him, John. I've been wanting to do this for a long time. Hey, that's it. Oh, the hairpiece is gone. I would have killed him, honestly. Yeah, why is this film better than the first straight up, man? It's so funny. And for what it's worth, as far as I'm concerned, you're a person. Of course, but we need our job back or something. Doesn't really matter what you think. Master Chief. You know my first ever Comic Con, I went just as Master Chief. Full ting, the full ting. Ted! Oh my god, he tanked it! He saved his life! Jesus, what happened here? The rocket ship just hit him! Jesus Christ, that's a Starship Enterprise! <laughs> Even I knew that. It was him! Did the guy dress like the Ninja Turtle? Oh, uh, well, we know it's Raphael. Oh, there's two Raphaels. Sam, give me your phone. Is he gonna play the song? Do you remember when he was dancing in front of the TV? Imagine if I call it right here. Do you remember the ass moves? I think we're alone now. Called it straight up. I think we're alone now. Johnny, you gotta wake up, pal. Johnny, wake up. Johnny, wake up. He's not actually dead, though. Are they making a Ted 3? I swear there's not a Ted 3 out. You know what would be funny? If they got Shia LaBeouf to be the new uh, Mark Wahlberg in this. Turns with table. I don't know, Miss Jackson. We've done everything we can. It's all up to him now. He's in a coma? Jesus. Just from getting smacked up a bit. Give him some metal plates like kick-ass. Somebody help! Well, he's not dead. Is he pranking them? I'm sorry. Um, didn't make it. I don't believe you. Say your goodbyes. What? I don't believe you. He can't die with those arms. And he's so dripped out with all his designer he's wearing. So that's a TikTok meme if you don't get that one. You gave up your own life to save mine. I don't know how my life works without you. Aww. I'm sure you'll get over it. 
Oh my god! That's so evil, though. There's no way she loves him after that. Wait, wait, how was the doctor in on it? Hey, doc, it worked out hilarious, thanks. No problem. We're a fun hospital. <laughs> no problem, we're a fun hospital. You're gonna have to do a lot better than that. Relationship with John Benno. How about married, baby? Oh, my gosh. Hey, if you guys want to bang, me and Teddy can totally leave the room. They're classy. They're not like us. Yeah, who's doing that in hospital bed? I saw what you did on TV. Is that good for the case? He willingly sacrificed himself? Give his life for yours? Reminded me of why I chose to do the kind of work I do. Money? Shall we get started? Such a good film. But again, let me know any other films like this, any comedies. Comment them below. And while you're at it, follow me on Instagram. Thank you. Yeah, where well, you can see all my Comic-Con pictures when I went. What is your name? Ted Clubberlang. <laughs> Clover Lang, such a good name. To change the world. Hey! He's a human being! Tammy Lynn McCafferty, will you marry me? Yes. You are the worst couple ever, I'm not gonna lie. Wait, now they can have a baby, right? Oh no, she's infertile. Thank God, honestly. Because they have them with a child. They adopted a fine. Uh, adopted? Uh, who let them? Oh. Apollo Creed Clover Lang. <laughs> Oh, that's cute. Is it alive? So that does it for Ted 2. And I don't know if this is a controversial opinion or not, but I thought this was funnier than the first one. You know, whether I'm in a better mood today, found it funnier than when I watched the first one or not, I have no clue, but I would love to know what your opinion on that is in the comments. And if you did miss a favorite moment, I'm not sure if there's some moments in this I couldn't even bring to YouTube. This was a pretty uh, gruesome film, but yeah, be sure to check out that Patreon in the description below. So I really hope you guys did enjoy this one. I had a blast. Be sure to drop a like and subscribe for more. Thank you guys all for watching and I'll see you on the next one.